Hallelujah. Glory to God. Shalom family. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus. See me for your very first time. This is the word and declaration with Lynette. Thank you so much for taking the pause to listen to this prophetic word. I pray it minister to you greatly. I pray through this prophetic word, God is going to give you direction in Jesus' mighty name. Please do not forget to like, share, and subscribe so you become part of this awesome family. Hallelujah. As for those returning as family, thank you so much. I love you all. God bless you. Father, we thank you for today, Lord. We glorify your name. Ancients of days, we give you all the praise for there is no one like you. Father, we are in your presence once more to hear from you. Lord, I pray that every heart that is ready to receive, may you bless them. I pray that whatever it is their heart so desire, may you grant their heart desires in the name of Jesus. Amen. The Lord says, you got them terrified. You got someone so terrified. The reason why they are terrified is because they heard about your testimony. You know, a lot of people have the tendency to give up on people. They have the tendency to conclude on people. This person I'm talking to, you were going through a very difficult moment. Things were a little bit difficult for you at the moment and someone that was close to you gave up on you. They felt like that is the end of your life. They felt like you are good for nothing. Now God is about to change the narratives. The Bible says, Joseph was so great. When he had visions about himself, he told these visions to his brothers. They were terrified and jealous. And they saw Joseph to become a slave. The Bible says, after everything Joseph went through, he still became what God wanted for him. His destiny still manifested. This person I'm talking to, a lot of people concluded on you. A lot of people concluded on you because they felt like nothing good can come out of you. But they didn't know that you are a child with a great destiny. You are a child with a prophecy on top of your head. The Lord says, now is the time for your destiny to manifest. Some of them look at you and they already perceive what is happening to you. They are already perceiving who you will become and they are so terrified. I pray for you. May the blessings of the Lord continue to flow over your life. I pray may God continue to increase you. I pray for those that have concluded on you. May God put them to shame in the name of Jesus. I pray for everyone whose destiny is being delayed. I pray may God intervene for you. May, destiny, may your destiny unfold in the name of Jesus. Amen. Thank you all so much for being a part of this session. I hope you receive this word with gladness. Please do not forget to turn on your notification bell so whenever I upload new content, you will be the first to know. I love you all so much, family, and see you in our next session. God bless you. Shalom.